All right, this drill is called the double kettlebell clean. Um, for me, this always felt, after I learned the basic mechanics of the clean, double cleans have always felt better for some reason. Um, part of it, I think, is that it's a little bit more weight in your hands, so it forces you to use a little bit sharper of a hip snap, okay? Um, something about the symmetry of two kettlebells going up also helps me learn how to push those kettlebell handles on nice and smooth, okay? So, because we have two kettlebells, we're going to have to stand a little bit uh, wider with our stance. Okay, so make sure that you got space between your feet. So, for example, mine are here um, versus where they might be a little bit closer together for my one-arm cleans. So, we got our kettlebells. Again, we're going to use the thumb as a guide on which corner of the handle to get our hands closest to. Okay, so just remember that thumb points the way. Arms are long. <sighs> going to get tight. Chest up. <sighs> okay, we're going to push them on keeping them nice and clean. Now, we're going to keep the kettlebells close together on the way down. We're going to let them drop before we follow them down. Nice and tight. Nice and tight. Okay. Because we have two kettlebells now, you want to keep them close on the way down. If you start with them farther apart, they go out they're inevitably going to come back together and they're going to smack away, okay? That could be around your knee region and you definitely don't want a kettlebell driving out into your knees, okay? So keep those kettlebells close. It also helps you feel like they're, you know, basically just one piece of equipment, okay, that you're trying to control on the way up and on the way down. Um, just like the regular clean, keep those bells close. Keep those kettlebells close as they're going down. Keep them close as they're coming up, okay? One of the best cues I've ever gotten about the kettlebell clean is don't pretend like you're trying to clean the kettlebell to your shoulder, okay, or your chest. Think about cleaning the kettlebell only to your waist. And then from here on up, you just push the hand on through and it's a nice smooth transition, okay? That's the double kettlebell clean.